Hi guys, I'm going to create a tutorial today on how to pay your multi-purpose loan in your Pag-ibig Fund using a Payat Center app in your mobile phone. So let's start the tutorial today. So let's start the tutorial today. Just open your Payat Center app and input your email or mobile number or your account in your Payat Center app and just input your password here and after you input everything that uh, needed in your Bayad Center application in your mobile phone just uh, tap the login button there you go it is uh, loading now and uh, it requires to input also your M pin, so you have to put your M pin. And now my account is loading. So I have the balance of twenty-one pesos in my uh, Buy It Center app, my fund balance, and I have to load it or uh, add some balance on my Buy It Center application. Now I'm going to scroll and uh, select what bank or what partner I will use for adding a balance in my buy at center application so for now I think I will use my uh, Banco de Oro bank or BDO because uh, I have uh, something on it I, I mean I have balance on my video but if you want to use other bank just uh, it's up to you so there you go there it is the instruction for this uh, application on how to uh, add a balance in your buy it center app so I will input this uh, amount and just uh, follow the instruction on the application so I'm going to uh, tap the button next step and then it will process now it's uh, processing already and it will load up the another uh, process page and uh, it says uh, there you go that, that's the instruction after you input everything you will you're going to uh, tap the submit button so uh, I'm going to uh, uh, open my video mobile bank I mean uh, I'm going to open my video application in my mobile phone and log in everything in my account that's the instruction of bio center application that you have to open your video application and uh, input everything or log in on your application on your video application and uh, you're going to uh, send um, man you're going to send a cash or send money from your video account so that you'll have the reference numbers so there you go my uh, video application has been loaded and I have to uh, check if I I'm in the right lane or I'm in the I'm following the instruction from the buy it center application so there it is uh, I'm going to check everything if it is uh, right and good so there it is uh, instruction says that I have to send money to 
any video account or I think uh, it's referring to uh, other bank or other uh, partner there you go uh, just tap the send money button in your video application and uh, tap to any video account and in the send from uh, button you have to uh, tap it and select the account you are going to use after that you're going to input the amount the exact amount you inputted in your buy at center application and in the destination account you have to uh, input the account number from your buy at center application there it is so I have to input it now after that you will have the this page you have this page and then the reference number is very important because it, you're going to use it in the buyout center application to complete the process and uh, the application will add a balance in your uh, fund balance so I'm going to input the reference number from my BDO application there it is it's very important please note it guys because uh, that's the that the reference number will be the transaction path from your buy and center up to BDO application or BDO bank there it is I'm going to input all and check all if it is correct and it is uh, right so just follow the instruction guys input uh, the reference number there you go from time to time I always check if the letters numbers I inputted in the uh, message box or the uh, the box is correct and uh, if it is uh, correct and it's good now I'm going to uh, top the button at the bottom part of the application so now it's correct and okay so I'm going to uh, top the button at the bottom part you just scroll down guys and you'll see that the submit button is below or at the bottom part of the application just stop it there you go the fund balance has not been loaded or no other balance you can check it at your uh, transaction history to stop the you'll see that the menu or the three bars at located at the top left just stop it and then transaction history just check the funding you'll see that uh, there's uh, a validation on that meaning it uh, the the bank is uh, processing it for validation so you'll see that the requested balance is under process and you have to wait for uh, I think uh, three hours or more than three hours for that validation after that you'll receive an SMS or a message that the requested balance is already processed and approved by the bank so you have to open again your buy and sender application just input everything to log in and then you're going to pay now your multi-purpose loan so 
you see that your balance is uh, already good and now you're going to uh, uh, select the pag ibig fan OFW and now you're you're going to input the uh, member ID or your reference number in your pag ibig so here guys I inputted my uh, member ID or my account number in my pag ibig fan after that I'll input the amount I'm going to pay in my pag ibig fan and then uh, select the short term loan and uh, select apply to amortization in my payment option and then select the the date or the date you paid for your multi-purpose loan or short-term loan and then the due date for this is uh, you have to review your multi-purpose loan due date and input it in your in this uh, form so here I uh, go I'm going to uh, select January I think February 16 or January 16 I think February 15 2022 is my due date and then select uh, the region Philippines you have to uh, scroll down and then select uh, what region from where you are uh, so I selected the uh, Philippines and then I inputted my contact number it's my mobile number so I'll just input it here after that just uh, top the next button and the application will uh, validate all the data you input it there you go the uh, the application is uh, before before the application proceed to the payment it will uh, give you an option that uh, are the the data you inputted on the form are they correct so uh, for me I'm going to check everything if I inputted a correct uh, data so it validating again the data there you go so now I'm uh, satisfied and all the data input is correct so I'm going to uh, tap the proceed button there you go the everything is uh, correct so I'm going to top the pay now button I already review everything so I know it's correct so there you go guys you'll see that the fund balance you have is already deducted so the process is uh, already done and everything is done for now uh, we are going to uh, check for now we are going to check if the uh, process or if the transaction you uh, did is already posted in your pag ibig fund or, or in your pag ibig account so we're going to check it in virtual pag ibig you can search it in your google 
search engine just type virtual pagibig and uh, your website will be will appear on your uh, search in your uh, device and then uh, just uh, log in your uh, online account if you have already or if you don't have you have to uh, be a member or you have to uh, sign up on in their uh, website so for now I have already my uh, virtual Pagibig online account so I am going to uh, log in I will input my email address and my password here there you go I'm going to input my password and after that I'm going to tap the login button if you don't have an account so you have to tap the create account button if you don't have the account in their online if you have just a login okay and there you go there is their uh, website you can check your uh, you can check your payments of your multi-purpose loan the past payments note guys that uh, in pa virtual pagibig you cannot uh, instantly check or the pagibig fund services you will not post immediately the transaction you did I think they're going to post it after three days it's my estimation only but I don't know if if it's three days or one week I'm going to check it 2021 has no transaction or no payments created now I'm going to check the 2020 payments in my multi-purpose loan there it is uh, all the transaction or the payments I did from 2020 is posted already and uh, you can check it you can uh, verify it if the data is correct so it's good and the payment is or and the payment are correct payments are correct so there you go guys everything is good and everything is uh, already uh, done so this tutorial this tutorial will uh, uh, add learnings on you and how to pay your multi-purpose loan by using the Biot Center application and your bank account note guys that there is no BPI uh, bank partner in Biot Center application so you have to use your BDO bank account East West etc just uh, select what bank you're going to use in your Biot Center application there it is guys we're done in our in our tutorial thank you very much for uh, watching my tutorial thank you so much and have a good day